Alright, camera rolling, mic test, mic test 1, 2. So guys, I get asked often, I fly my planes in mode 1 back in the day and I want to get into drones, so should I change and relearn mode 2? Well, in this episode, let's talk about it. What's up fam, Rahim here and welcome to another TGIF episode. Guys, it's a Friday so let's get straight into the topic. So not only do I get this question in the comments but also I have guys PMing me and asking Rahim, I want to learn drones but maybe like they used to fly helis or they used to fly planes and they were either in mode 1 or mode 3 and for the most part drones are in mode 2. So Rahim, should I go and convert and learn mode 2? So the answer I'm going to give you is a no. And maybe yes. So let's get some basics about it. So if you were to go into the controller settings in the goggles, you'll see that there is options to choose between mode 1, 2 or 3. Right? For myself, I've set up as mode 2. So what is mode 2 is basically on the left stick, you'll have your throttle and also your yaw. And then on the right is going to be pitch and roll. Right? So what is mode 3 then? Mode 3 is actually just flipping these two controls right and then there is mode one where your is here roll is here but now here is gonna be pitch and here's gonna be your throttle so here's an overview of the three different modes now credits go to stack exchange for the diagram and if you want to learn more check out the link in the description so yes i am a mode 2 pilot i do have friends that fly either in mode 1 or mode 3 and then there's this one guy who flies in all modes simply because is he explained it as Rahim, I prefer flying my drones in mode 2 but because I also do 3D heli uh, and also planes and so depending I prefer mode 1 or mode 3. So what am I driving at here is that a part of me feels that it doesn't matter. Um, I'm kind of optimistic when I'm learning stuff right so if I received it a certain way I probably just keep learning it in that way. If you've already learned um, flying drones in mode 3 there's no need to change, right? If you're comfortable with it, you can keep going. But of course, the other part of me is going to mention that most of drones, all right, uh, controls in general, uh, from what I see is in mode 2, right? Just now I mentioned that I got it that way. Yes, majority of my friends are in mode 2. Um, that we all kind of started with either DJI drones or toy grid drones, right? And toy grades are mostly in mode 2 and I kind of preferred it that way not because of oh okay mode 2 feels more natural or whatsoever I'm right handed left handed it doesn't matter I just prefer it in mode 2 simply because a lot of tutorials that I've learned from were in mode 2 I've decided to also um, continue in FPV in mode 2 and then I'm also sharing the knowledge in mode 2 Plus, if I were to want to share with others like, oh, okay, you wanted, you want to get into drones, then maybe you could get yourself a toy drone to try out or even try out my drones, which are also in mode 2. So, it's kind of not that I'm trying to sell you the idea of mode 2 because it's the way to go, but it's more of... Um, what is your comfort level if you are okay with being in mode 1 mode 3 mode 4 and learning it right uh, adapting so called because i see do i do see a lot of tutorials are in mode 2 and if you're okay to adapt that way then just carry on nobody's gonna stop you there's no need for you to change uh, but if you kind of feel that you want to be a bit more easier learning curve um, that's my opinion then probably mode 2 is gonna be your way to go right so you there's no hard and fast rule on that it's just preference so you can decide whether you prefer mode 1 2 3 or even mode 4 all right guys there has been a quick sharing and i hope it gives you a better understanding of the different controller modes now i also believe that there are experienced pilots also watching this episode and i ask for your help leave a comment down below what mode are you using and also why do you use that mode it's just so that when uh, the new guys coming by reading the comments they can learn and we can all grow together in this community of drone pilots right guys that's gonna wrap it up for the last episode of 2022 now the new year is right around the corner wishing you guys a happy new year and may all your dreams come true for 2023 as for myself resolution is gonna be i need to declutter right i need to be better minimalism right now go out there it's a friday guys meet up with your friends family and loved ones 
Happy celebrations, stay safe, and we, as always, I'll see you in the skies. Peace.